Hi Aquarius, this is Shah and this is your weekly reading for the 16th to the 22nd of March. And welcome back to the channel everybody, whether you're a cyber angel or a new viewer. And I hope you enjoyed the romance readings because they are already up and running and I'm sorry I'm a little bit late this month but there are new uh, developing things so have a look at the video updates and news at the end of this video I'll put it in the back screen so click on it okay I'm doing three things I'm going to read charms and I'm going to see whether the charms will relate you you can see whether the charms relate to the cards or the crystal ball those are the three elements I'm going to do this week so bear with me I'm not looking at what I'm pulling and that's why I'm rummaging around in the little box and I'm just going to throw them out on the table oh sorry these were from the last reading so let's get back All right right I'm not using the cards I'm not doing it at the end of the reading now I need a bead those are easy to get right you've got the orange bead okay let's have a look oh you've got two locks and this one is on its side so uh, well you've got two locks and this one is on its side something might be locked up and you might be trying to tweak it or tweak it and it's the lock on with a heart on it it could be love it could be uh, your own heart or somebody else's heart perhaps you're trying to tweak somebody's heart that you fancy okay that's interesting you've got the other lock and it's lying upside down uh, towards to, yeah like the lock is like this lying opposite so it could be something that's general that's being locked up your feelings your heart and you perhaps you're trying to open somebody else's heart interesting it could be love and it could be something general perhaps uh, you're trying to unlock luck I would interpret this as your heart chakra and your solar plex perhaps you are trying to do research that's what I'm also getting unlocking knowledge asking questions and you're not getting any answers interesting interesting so this and you've got the dice Wow the dice means you've got the flat lock okay I've got the lock but you haven't got a key this is with an open uh, keyhole so perhaps you're trying to seek knowledge looking for knowledge and the possibilities are locked up the hide the officially secret perhaps they're locked away and this is the heart lock there you go I hope you can see it the heart on the lock then we've got the dice the dice ooh, it's jumpy jumpy so are you gambling with something are you gambling with your heart? That's the dice. Perhaps you're gambling in, or somebody around you is gambling. Would be interesting to see what it, it is in the reading. And you've got the wheel, and the wheel means um, a wheel of a car, the wheel of fortune. Perhaps you might be going on holiday because it's a steering wheel of a ship. Okay, something has come round full circle, new beginnings, end of a face, moving home, uh, crossing water to move home, perhaps immigrating. Then we've got the charm, the anchor. Yes, you've got a yes coming home to a safe haven. You're feeling safe where you are or where you're going to because it's coming after the wheel now we've got the orange chakra and that's the secretal chakra that's the sexy chakra sensual chakra um, 
perhaps this is a message to be more sexy or more sensual so you can open up your heart perhaps it is take a gamble to have a passion orange is also the color of passion and it is also an angel, archangel uh, angelic chakra uh, color and that's the um, angel Gabriel so call up in upon angel Gabriel if you need him Wow lots of messages so let's go into the crystal ball and I'll have to clean it first because I used it for Capricorn and with a pure cotton cloth I'm cleaning it last time it was with a sort of paper because that's what it came in in paper plastic paper a little bag but I'm using it for decks okay let's have a look <sighs> I don't know what you want me to do okay here we go Ooh, the cosmos is definitely with you I'm seeing like a circle and in that circle is a lot of mist so here you are something is not clear okay locked away secrets let's have a look let's have a look here we go no. I'm seeing a letter V I'm also seeing a letter K V K Okay, K, kind. Could be a name, Karen. Uh, Karen, Kian, Kyle. Those are three names that are coming up. I know not. I know that not everybody has somebody around them that is called Karen or Kyle. But perhaps this is will be a specific reading meant for people with that name I also see two people doing diving whether it's diving from a board or scuba diving I think it's more like scuba diving I also get to hear marine biology marine biology Um, well we've got the wheel and I did say travel I think some of you might be going uh, to a country that's got a point in the corner could be Chile South America Africa or India and I think you might be doing scuba diving or perhaps research with a team because I've seen more than two people swimming and hanging around rocks okay I'm seeing a V that was also like this but just uh, I just don't know but I just don't understand it but I'm seeing this V like I don't know whether you can see that but it's a, a circle here and it's more like um, a canine tooth a pointy tooth but going out in a circle and it is also if you look at the card of the world that could be Africa India or uh, Chile South America that point you might be going there on holiday you might be working there you might be even immigrating to those countries it's not clear whether you should do that perhaps that is a secret you might 
you might be keeping it a secret from family or friends as it's not really totally clear to you yet 75% is yes and 25% is if I get to hear the word if or but could it be if you um, uh, get or if you get a visa if you can get a visa but but it might be delayed I'm also seeing branches branches it might be I don't think it's a tree I don't see a tree it's branching out branching out I see branches just branch branches I don't see the tree okay branching out and I get the word bunch bunch branch bunches of branches I don't know the, I don't see anything else darlings okay so Aquarius let's get on to your reading branches, branches. perhaps taking a gamble in branching out if you've got a business Let's see what the cards say. Well, travel did come in. Travel did come in. Okay, that's coming out. Wow, I was talking about branches. Look at the tree, the world, the four seasons. You might be traveling the world or a part of the world. And I was talking about 75%. So that could be when spring, because this is winter, this is spring, summer, and autumn. Perhaps you might be going away for 75% of the time, uh, the three quarters of a year. Crazy. And I don't do things with time. Then we have the. Um, seven of arrows the seven of swords sneaky no it's something is not clear perhaps you're sneaking away from the family or not telling them okay Ooh. sneaky the queen of swords you could be sneaking away in you are the an air sign you are an air sign um, but the queen of swords is Libra so you might be sneaking away with a Libra ooh, ooh, ooh. nice nice ooh, ooh. this is this is like a storyline wow and then you've got the mirror and the mirror is the moon oh could it be the hermit let me get into that picture I love these cards and I have this is about the second or the third time that I have used them and that's why I looked at this card and the tail of the mermaid goes like the legs of the hanged man and you can see somebody a Viking's death somebody drifting there in suspension that meditative meditative state so there is suspension so that's the hanged man the mirror is the hanged man okay awesome now those are the five cards for the week and here we go I hope you can still see them we'll get back to the cards and the bottom of the card is the great bear that is judgment I think yeah that is the bear you can see the rising energy the rising dead or the angels energy coming out of his winter sleep it's lovely to de depict it okay and now we're going on to this
this is the House of Shadows by Monica Davinsky and we've got the cross decisions then you've got the garden reunion and meetings gatherings clover and the birds again news and meetings and then we've got the fish okay we'll go into this reading a little bit more in depth and the cat is sitting here she wants her food she'll just have to wait okay well this is for Monday the 16th and I was talking about trees and leaves in the crystal ball okay time of year I was also talking about quarter to the 75 percent okay uh, the world is a beautiful place so long you can see it okay the world in tarot means something is coming to an end perhaps an end to a season will this uh, three Yes, so we are coming to an end of season. We're coming to the end of winter. We're going into spring. Sorry, this is spring. Okay, and spring uh, is also the air element. So, again, swords. So, uh, let's have a look. This deck is so um, concentrated, it's got a lot of, uh, you can see a lot of things in it, you can see a lot of symbols in it, because of its art and its complexity. Now, here in the bottom of the card, it's the first time I'm seeing it, is a door, and you've got the Limbrith, but the Limbrith don't have any, it's like a puzzle, um, it's the, the walk of life. That's the way, your life path, but um, a limbrith is also going on and on, and that's why you see the circle. And it is th there is no blockages on the limbrith, but you're going through another phase, another doorway. You can go into a new doorway. A world will open up a new season. You might be going on holiday you might be moving home okay the door of a new home okay there might be a path this week where you're going to, into a new home a new beginning a new job a new relationship have a look with this leading reading with your romance reading Aquarius okay we've got that was number 21 the world and also the world is the karma card so if you've done good um, you will get it back threefold the same with negativity and same if somebody's done it to to you like I said the something comes full circle so an end of a face you perhaps you are cutting uh, the end and here again you've got the wheel of a wheel so like the wheel of fortune end of a face moving home holiday and the leaves are obviously in what I saw in the crystal is coming back into the tree well you've got 36 and that and you've got the cross so have faith have trust in yourself come out of your head there again um, the world has the four seasons so and we uh, we're talking about quarters so we're coming into spring okay so an air sign come out of your head okay come out of your head I know this is a cross but it all, also if you take a quick look it looks like a sim uh, a sword now, this is the handle and then this is the sword so I'm getting the feel of air here okay and also because we are in March uh, spring air that's the sign of air 
so um, you might be clearing the air um, yeah definitely you're you're in your head don't go around in circles come out of your head don't be depressed like I said trust yourself have faith 36 an end an end of a phase an end of a quarter that is what marches we're also going in to well not this week uh, this is the 16th to the 22nd so there you are we're coming to the end of Aquarius Aquarius we're going in to oh sorry no we're hang on a minute what is it uh, so we're, we're already in Pisces we're coming to the end of Pisces okay so you've got to think a lot this is this reading is really cracking my skull okay again you've got the seven of air so that's the seven of swords so you've got a lot of air in your reading so and you've got the queen of air which is Libra okay so you might be meeting up with a Libra or there is something with a Libra uh, the seven of uh, arrows is the seven of swords insecurity you might feel insecure or somebody might be sneaky could be you as well if you're immigrating and you're thinking about it and you may have to make a decision there might be a family member that's a Libra that doesn't like it it could be a mother figure because it's the Queen of Air okay there will be meetings gatherings uh, perhaps a birthday there might be a birthday that a party that you might be going to this could be in the family it could be that you might be reuniting with somebody at one of these meetings you might be networking around the world and they might be a, 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 a Libra be careful though because the seven of swords means sneaky insecurity so somebody might not be telling you the truth listen to your gut feeling have faith to that and the ideas that are coming into your head then we've got the Queen of Air and the Queen of Air is Libra Aquarius it could be you you could be um, I th this is not a love reading this is a general reading so I think it could be uh, the cards aren't sexist so it could even be a man uh, an air sign man with a, a, a nurturing side uh, a beautiful side to them okay he might help you to get clarity she definitely will she will cut they will cut straight through to the core and get clarity and honesty so if somebody has been sneaky and have done you wrong like I said they will get it back clarity and will come back and honesty will prevail that will you've got luck you will be back at the end mid end of the week on Friday you'll be back in luck you've got the clover but you've also got two you've got a 20 here the garden so that's also a two you from midweek onwards you will be in balance again and then you've got the hanged man something might be in delay like I said with the crystal wall you are not telling family members that you might be immigrating or having a job for a while I said 75 well here we've got a 7 okay I still feel that you might be traveling because this is the hanged man perhaps you are stalling or delaying to tell them your news perhaps you are taking time to think about it because the hanged man means spiritual spirituality so your spirituality your emotions might be or your intuitiveness might be heightened you might be getting new ideas this might be a new idea and it could be be stalling for four hours four days or four weeks or four months there you are 
so you could be stalling until the end of April so end of March because that's the first quarter so something will come to daylight perhaps at the end of March perhaps you're waiting for news and you're using your time that delay or that meditative contemplation contemplative time to think about it to make your choice perhaps you are waiting for news because you've got the birds but be careful of gossip and this could also be meetings gatherings presentations people are talking so be careful when the birds means somebody is flying the coop or has flown the coop or left the group okay so there again somebody's flying out could be you okay I've got a feeling it's you okay a new start because you've got the world justice card here a new beginning or a second chance wow the great bear and the great bear is the north star so I might be wrong <laughs> with going south you might be going north or it might be your right path when I get the moon I always say you know follow the light on your path that's to the north star okay if your intuition is saying this this trip is what you want to do and that is the way to go about it and feels good and you are take a gamble but make sure like ah security lock things away security make sure you are protected and make sure your trip is safe okay they used to use chastity belts be careful <laughs> okay and again sneaky there might be somebody sneaky on that trip so make sure that things are safe papers are safe uh, visums uh, your suitcase is safe that you can lock things safely away without people stealing or being tempted to take things that doesn't belong to them there will be a second chance yes definitely you will have luck in business and a luck at work we've got fish and we are talking about scuba diving wow this is crazy swimming fish okay 34 7 good luck again know your boundaries know your boundaries set your boundaries lock those nobody is allowed to cross those boundaries wow amazing okay I think I have more or less come to the end so you might be meeting an, an other air sign uh, this could be a lady because you've got the Queen of Air I think you're in your element like she's beautiful the swan is absolutely beautiful but the Queen of Air is Libra so you could be meeting a Libra or an other member luck is definitely um, around you you've got two luck cards you've got two twos so two is imminent so you might even be partnering up with somebody on this travel again here we've got 22 a second chance I take this card usually it says justice says um, new beginning but it the Gabriel blows life into the living dead so that is a second chance for life okay 222 two, two is imminent so we've got 222 two, two. that's an also an angel number okay my darlings uh, amazing okay this is a mind-blowing reading this is the only negative card okay so be warned don't be insecure and make sure your stuff if you're taking a trip is not in risk of insecurity okay and take time out to think about it contemplate about it 
and evaluate it so that you've got every dot uh, uh, I dotted and all your T's crossed. I get a warning paperwork get your paperwork sorted out and this is Archangel um, Gabriel so make sure that you can you eat orange or meditate on the orange it's also your sexy or sensual chakra okay your sexy you might be s beaming this orange light out beauty sexiness okay so take care of yourself make sure you are secure you can take the gamble but make sure you are safe I love this reading really really okay Aquarius I hope you did please like and share this reading with family and friends have a brilliant week I'll see you either in the life or in the next video ciao ciao Thank you.